I enjoy being a wizard in games. It's, it is by far the most enjoyment, or the most enjoyable class for me. If we're playing like an MMO or like playing role playing games, whatever, I like casting spells. So why not play a wizard game that's a roguelike and enjoy it? Hopefully. <laughs> Thank you, it's just coming out. It's early access, obviously. Um, and I'm wanting to try it. So let's jump right in. What are the differences? Oh, this one's a guy and this one's a girl. Um, what do we both play the guy? That is my name. Confirm. Hope there's a tutorial. It's been a while since I played the first one. Ah, there you are. There, here what I am. Are waiting for you? One of the rare few chosen for the trials. I am Sergeek, keeper of the arcane secrets. Hello, and Sergeek. It's my duty to ensure you wield the power of Arcana. Okay. And I am Madame Moulon, the historian of relics in the trials of legend. The historian of relics. It's your what true title? Self. The question is, which element defines Which you? element? What element defines me? Whoa! Let's just start and this will determine your initial arcana. You can change your arcana later in the game. So what do I want? Fire, that wind, ground, electric, or water. Uh, not gonna lie. Probably gonna choose electric. I think electric's pretty good. Lightning, unpredictable, fierce, and deadly. Few can harness such. Did you ban someone? You. Let the storms guide your journey. The trials await you, Thunderstruck. What the fuck? Did you mean that? Damn, I'm quick. Let me go. You launch into a sprint. Okay, A is to dash. Let's get let's get a grip of the controls. A is to dash. X is. Zzz, zzz. What determines the direction this is going in? It just always seems to be going that direction. Okay. That was really good. Ah, okay. Okay. Quite like this. This looks pretty good. Zap, 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 zap. We've got a big long zap here. How are you supposed to aim it? Is it because my mouse is on screen? Ah, oh, I think it was because my mouse was on the screen. I use controller for these kind of games. I think it's easier. Okay. And then RBs. Ooh, I've got this kind of ice. Ice rain one as well. Yeah, cool. Big long zap. Big ice range. Okay, cool. What was I to do? What did they want me to do? Oh, there's like a cooldown. For some reason I had it in my head I could just spam. You cannot just spam. I'm liking the updated graphics. The, the graphics in the other one were definitely, or are definitely dated now. I felt like they were a bit outdated at the time as well. God damn, okay, fair enough. You want to do that to me? That's You're fine. You're not alone in this, young one. We're watching your every move, offering guidance as you go. Okay, offering me guidance. We support you on your journey beyond the battlefield. Yeah, so the first one—I don't know—the graphics. The first one never, ever, never struck with me, but I quite like the graphics in this. But Hades, like it is quite Hades, like actually. But I like that this the style of Hades kind of ages well, which I think helps it. We'll see how we get on as we go. Definitely feels pretty smooth so far. The blue bar beneath your health gate represents the signature bar. Once it's completely filled, your signature arcana becomes charged. Activating a signature arcana consumes this charge, allowing to cast its ultimate and unleash its full power. So what's my... Whoa! Okay. Okay. I'm like, uh, who's that guy for, for Spider-Man? The lightning guy. What's here? 
That plant looks... Oh! Okay, so you can fall off. Interesting. Plants look as if they were breakable. Now, I don't know what the, the final win condition is for this. Of whether or not it's like um, beating bosses or if it's just doing a bunch of rounds or whatever, but... Um, I'm interested to see where it takes us, to be honest. Ow. Ow. Okay, that will be my ultimate. It's what, what I want to happen in this. So I've not seen any gameplay apart from having played the first game. What I want to be able to do is combine water and electricity. Why does my mouse keep coming back on the screen? I want to be able to combine water and electricity and kind of combo them. Because you could combo stuff in the first one, I'm sure. Burn nearby enemies, increase max HP by 50, killing enemies using your signature, increases its damage by 2%, capped at 80%. That is quite strong. I'm feeling okay about health. We'll take the soul medallion. Start charging up our ultimate. I just need to remember and use it. Oh, look at this sweet. Every challenge <laughs> you overcome brings you one step closer to become the wizard of legend. It is no simple task. That little animation was quite cool. Of them, uh moving my character along kind of what looked like a board, like a board game. Quite liked it. <laughs> you can just stun them. How do I know if this is leveling up then? Ah, okay. Battery of Tenaris. Increase all of your lightning damage. I don't know how you see stats or anything like that. I'm betting Hello. you can handle this. Prove. Can. Handle what? Oh, it's like a challenge. A big guy. Oh, that hurt. The only thing about this electricity attack is that it's really short range. Like, my, my kind of base attack is really short range. Really? Now two of them? Ow. There we go. I handled it. Somewhat. What did that get me? No idea. Did it get me money? It maybe, gave, maybe got me money. Big room of enemies again. This, uh, this one we've got here, this ice ball, is pretty strong. The, the ice rain. Oh, no way. Let's get them all in. Nice rain. I have my couple of zaps. Why not? I need to to wait. Delay my dash. A bit better. These big guys are hurting. I've only got 60 health left. You don't start with a lot of health. Oh he had he had a shield? That's quite cool. So his shield broke. Oh no. His shield broke when I did enough damage to him. That's quite cool. I like that. There's another one. Another two enemies coming. Anything over here? Oh, I'm locked in a room now. I did slam damage to him. I think it was because I pushed him into the wall. And to shoot. Move in for the hit. You can stun them. Ooh, cheeky. 
Here's my ultimate. There we go. Clears that room out. These ones still up? Yeah, they are. Okay, so the enemies don't disappear when you leave, of, which kind of makes sense. At least stick around. I don't know if there's any bonus. I do seem to be getting money from killing stuff. 136 on that. Didn't get anything for killing that last guy. Or that one. But are they just in the way? Hey, this looks like a shop. Hello. Mordom's gem. Okay. The Jing's right hand. Right hand fights beside you. It won't aggro enemies. That's cool. Mirror of Constitution. Doubles any HP boost you get. That's a HP boost. The left hand, fast and light, left the hand that fights beside you by throwing fireballs at enemies. Okay, we've got 136 at the moment. We can teleport. Oh, there's a chest there that I seem to have missed. Hold on a second. Can I look at the map? How do you see them? Down on the D-pad seems to be the map, but there's no map controls. Hmm. Lack of map controls is annoying. Yeah, so what's that? Oh, a chest! Did that get me plus two? Plus four? Did that get me money? Is that it? Money seems to come from pots more than anything else, by the looks of it. Which is fine. There must be a way to generate money. I will probably buy a health upgrade at the shop. I'm gonna go back here and grab a health upgrade. And see what's going on. Noticing the lack of um, controls is a bit kind of annoying. There, there's definitely controls missing from here. Um, in terms of like menus and what whatnot. That is an early access, but basic stuff. And there's no real tutorial. I think I'm still in the tutorial. I don't know. I don't know how to tell. I think this is the tutorial still though. Little birds. Oh, the tree guy? Oh, he's got a fast attack. See, this is where I think a fire attack would be good. Oh, what's this? Red crystal? Oh, that was health. Okay, nice. That was a lot of health. Sweet. Where do we go? Right or... Up, right or left. This is a chest. Probably going to make me fight for it. I'm guessing. Damn. Okay. Didn't know they did that. Whoa! Look at these guys. Yeah, I got you. Enhancement Infuser increases your damage by 10% and another 10% per upgraded Arcana. Okay, this so we... Enhancement Infuser you've chosen was made to amplify Arcana enhancements. Okay. Despite its power, the Extra 10%. Dan Icarus discarded it as a failure for encouraging complacency. Extra 10% damage per Arcana upgrade we've got. Not terrible, at least. I just need to figure out how to upgrade Arcanas now. Oh, not this guy with the boulders. Oh my days, that hurt. Oh, you're dead now. Easy. I was counting the boulders that elite skull diggers throw. Your victory interrupted the study. Oh, apologies. 
It was going to kill me, so I had to do something. I'm going to try and teleport down the bottom here. I did notice there's stuff. There's something down to the right in the bottom of the map here. Oh, it's another shop. Flame Strike. Oh, this is different abilities. This is Arcanas. Cast away, right, so we want, I want water, Breakers of Tiamat, that sounds cool, look at the icon for that, that's cool, with the dragons, 200 gold though, what can we get, Tearing Whirlwind, Spin Rapidly, Generating a Powerful Whirlwind that draws enemies inwards, maintain mobility while spinning, or blast enemies away with plumes of flame that can be charged to boost effectiveness, let's take Tearing Whirlwind, but the reason being that if I bring them in, I can then cast the ice rain down on top of them. And that will um That will do more damage to them. Okay. Do we move on? Yeah, look. I like this little like uh, board game character looking thing. Some health. That was only 20 health, that one. A boss fight? Ooh, first boss fight. I should have taken the fire move. Prepare yourself for my Frost Queen Anita. Style. Anaita. Water. Impossible to pin down. Oh, what the hell? How is this like the tutorial boss by the way? What is going on here? Oh No Oh, great. Oh, I don't know if she hit me, I would take damage. Well. Stage reach 1 3. That was pants. She was so quick. How am I supposed to get her? Ah, uh, finally awake. You put up quite the fight out there, but no one said becoming the Wizard of Legend was simple. Welcome home. When you're ready, meet me at the training grounds. I've got a little surprise. A surprise for me at the training grounds. Okay, okay, Sergic. Let's go and see what he's got. What's this? Oh, you can change a cloak. Or crystals? Okay. I wonder how you get crystals. I've got 38, so I don't know how you get them. Multiplayer, you can be by five players. Oh, cool. Online co-op, that's cool. I do like uh, an online co-op in a game like this. Where am I going? Uh, where's the training grounds then? Here, take these. A few chaos gems. Chaos gems, Pure okay. magical energy. And the key to unlocking new arcana. Go ahead, pick whatever speaks to you, and I'll shape their raw energy. Craft it into something you can control. Ooh, okay. You need chaos. So, the currency that I use to unlock clothes also. Hey, well, I want, the the, I want this war one, don't I? Are raw power. Their true strength lies in how you master them. Finished. Your arcane is crafted. 
Tomi, the living spellbook awaits. So you're Equip the spellbook? Your arcana. The right one in your hands changes the game. Their primary combat abilities, these mystical cards are inscribed with P-set spells to infuse with magic. Okay. Oh, there's like a mystery element, like right here, see it? Basic. Electric. Signature. Standard. Breakers of Tiamat. What's this? Oh, this whole bit's the training ground, actually. Hold on. Ooh, look at that! That's cool looking. That's so cool looking. No, like, watery effect, though. Just a kind of cool... With Sir Jig already? Good. Welcome, Welcome to the Trials, to the Mansion. Trials Mansion. A place for the most capable. Here you can rest, regain your strength, and move... Okay. So this is just... This is just the, the pre... Adventure area, I'm guessing. And we're off. All Back again, let's go! New Arcana, I realize one truth. Power alone isn't enough. These haven't changed. Okay, kind of disappointing. Are these ones up here going to change? No, right, okay, so they're all the same. There seems to be a kind of predefined way to unlock this stuff. I thought it maybe would be random. He may drive me it's mad, not. but I respect him. Uh, well, I want to try and do something with dragons. If I can get another dragon ability, that would be decent. Uh, it doesn't seem to be. Spin once, fireball. Not enough gems. Okay, we don't have enough gems for fireball. Never mind. Let me take the dragon's eye on this quest. Who are you? I've been expecting you. I am Nazradin, uh, the one who controls the rules of the tribe. Okay. Choose a rune and choose a rune or shift the fabric of. Ah, dangers on a magical pouch that draws wealth to you. Start with a hundred gold, giving you more resources than going to spend spree. Ah, okay. I mean, yeah. I'll take a an upgrade. That's not very obvious. What when you're clicking here, is it? It's the dark one. Runes Weird. Influence the trials, bending the rules to fit your choices. Okay. Uh, ability is. Uh, so there's a lot of Let's being able to modify the, trials shifting rules. the game to yourself Careful, or to your really desire, which is cool. Under your hand, Nazradin, the trials are I've just fair. jumped into that. Easy. Okay, so there seems to be a, quite a bit of kind of customization, maybe making it your own difficulty or making it easier for yourself and stuff. That's pretty cool. I don't actually mind that. There's a lot of these that are kind of standard. This is how you play. These are this is the difficulties and stuff like that. And it's quite good to have that customization to be able to pick and choose and suit what you want to play or how you want to play. Oh, we're getting damage upgrade here. Fifty percent undamaged enemies, ten percent cooldown. Critical chance. Uh, let's take. Let's take. Fifty percent undamaged enemies. And we'll see what that brings. If we start with that as attack, as a kind of base attack, it should maybe do extra damage. I don't think it is. Ow? Okay. I mean, I don't think the damage has changed much since going into this, to be perfectly honest. 
our sense was started to our sense of upgraded up there. I need to take that corner thing out. The spawner is gonna hurt. Lots of damage. Very nice. What we got here? All of your water damage by 15%. 20% more damage to staggered enemies. Increases his crit. Right, so we want the water damage because we're doing dragons. And we have water dragons. Makes sense. We'll take the water damage increase and we'll head on out of this level. The levels are pretty short. Don't hate it. It's better than like the levels being too long and you feel like you're stuck there forever. Oh. Big damage. You can definitely get stuck in levels, kind of and the ones that come to mind are like Risk of Rain. Because of the way the Risk of Rain scales. You can get stuck in levels trying to get money for boxes and, and stuff, depending on how long you've been in the run. And it definitely feels like you get stuck at that point. What we got here? Spark Array. Cast a wave, small electrical orbs and arc. Nah, we don't want that. We want dragons. Mistral Arrow. Stone Shot. I don't want any of these. Let's get power ups this turn, I think. Try and make our abilities stronger as opposed to buying other abilities. There we go, what else we got? Blast. They don't take damage from that? No way. Oh, he did. Weird. 10% crit for Breakers of Tiamat. Volt Surge. Unleash a lightning bolt that zaps from foe to foe. Is that not what mine does already? Bolt rail? No, no. Bolt surge? Yeah, bolt surge. Oh, it's just giving it 10% crit. Never mind. <laughs> I'm just stupid. 75% uh, Oh, that's a big upgrade for bolt rail. I kind of want to take... 10% attack speed, 75% damage to undamaged enemies. I wonder if that's... Plus 75%, which would make it 125%, or if it just increases it to 75%, let's find out. It increases it to 75%. Okay, that's good to know. So they don't stack. Buffs like that don't stack. Crazy if it stacked, though. If that had stacked and it was then 125% um, damage, ooh, you'd be able to like cheese your way to get some dumb builds by doing that. There we go. Skull archers can appear anywhere in the jungle, and yet their arrows couldn't stop you. Nah, the the arrows. The only person that stops me so far is that dumb ice boss. Ooh. I've got so much damage it felt like there. That felt like I had loads of damage with that.
I will miss the uh, little fire turret we had though. That was good, that was useful. Hey fellas, you got zapped. I almost pressed right trigger instead of right bumper and panicked. Oof. Uh, is this a shot? It is. What you got for me? Increases your damage based on your current HP. Okay. Basic attack adds a stackable buff that increases your damage on your next standard attack. 5% staggered. 5% after a, a charge signature. Slow all enemies by 20%. Ooh, actually, I might not mind that. Restore 75 health. What have I got? 140. I'm going to get health at the start of the next one. I can spend here. Let's take... The hmm. Let's take the extra. No, I don't want that. I don't have a way of staggering enemies. I don't think. Dealing enough damage. The elite enemies and bosses will fill their stagger bar when staggered. They are rendered harmless and open to attacks. Actually, I might take that and the crown. So I think the stagger attack is when we, when we were hitting the ice queen the last time. She was having a little shield broken. You dare to face me in back. Uh, sure. Yourself. She was having a little thing where her shield would break, and I think that is her staggered. Whoa! Look at that attack. That's cool. Fun time rubbing guys tonight, that's good. Blizzard Arcana. Okay. How was this though? Oh, this is the one we started with, okay. Before we got our new one. I like this one. I did like this one. Oh, I knocked him down the hole! I actually knocked him down the hole. <laughs> the soil must be thinning. Skulls are appearing without the help of skull diggers. Okay. I mean, we're kind of getting. We're back to the. We're back to the ice queen again. I'm glad you had a good time. That's good. Good stuff. Good stuff. We have slightly less health this time. Not ideal, but if we can stagger her, then maybe be chilling. So we do 20% extra damage. Do you so we'll see how it goes. Like this, is this stagger? Ah. Got her. Woo. Let's the go. Can turn from calm to chaos in a splash. Better stay frosty. I like how she's just standing there, like, hmm, yes, indeed. Arcane Chromo acquired. Forgotten Arcana variants wielded by ancient master wizards, these forgotten variants are altered versions of Arcana. 
new and more potent magic, empowering the wielder to overcome trials. Cool. Oh. Ultimate Tiamat. So my regular attack becomes... Wait, that's my ultimate. Becomes Volt Stream Surge. Unleash a volley of lightning bolts that jump to nearby foes. Rail Circuit Channel. A short stream of lightning that jumps to other targets. Or Water Giant's Rush Forward. Getting more. Cast the ultimate version when the signature bar is full to unleash multiple waves. I think we maybe take Volt Stream Surge, to be honest. Oh, that could be good. Hey, zone four, first time, let's go. What are we getting here? We're still in the jungle. Interesting. This port. Okay. Where does this take us? Oh, what the hell is this? Oh no. Oh no, I made a big mistake coming here. Yep. Spend arcane chromo at the trials mansion to overcome that. Damn it! I can't believe I fell off straight away. <laughs> oh, good God. <laughs> Oh look, is this the One quest day, board? I want to travel across Lenovo like Zerzhik did. I've never even seen the ocean before. Took the easy way out? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Best claim reward? Okay. Okay, so these just give you a bunch of chromo rewards and gems. I mean, that's pretty decent. At least there's there's Mother another way me so many to cool get stuff. About his inventions. He even let me crawl inside one. You have beaten frost. Now try making the, the rules harder. I don't want to. Hearthstone. Heartstone of healing. Increase maximum health by 75. Perfect those. Perfect for those who need a little staying power. You've returned. Flavie, how's it going? How are you doing? So I'm guessing this upgrade gives you more money. What's this? Pit Lord. This is the only one you can upgrade. Equip. Every adjustment I make okay. to the trial balance is precise. Frost Queen and a heater's downpour isn't easy. I made it. I'm preparing to go again. I am preparing to go again. What you got for Sitting me? On all Nothing. Those chaos gems Nothing good. Not crafting new You've amassed quite a collection of chaos gems. Unlock some relics. Eh. Uh, eh. Yeah. We don't really have summons. When I feel like I my school, money is better spent than buying so these. The teacher barely got to speak. Fireball that explodes on impact. Big punch. Rocks. Let's get fireball. Why not? Oh, dragons! Yeah, summon a torrent of fiery dragons. This is what we want. We want more dragons. Aqua bubble. Ooh, that would be cool. Wait. Oh, no. All my dragons are this S type. This one sounds cool. A torrent of fiery dragons. Ooh, okay. So this is like a short range. Huh. Oh. Okay. I don't mind it. Don't mind it. Let's head back. Dragonborn, how was your events for the evening? As your starter relic. It looks kindly on Dragon Arcana and only Dragon Arcana. I know that it only works on Dragon Arcana, but I've got dragons in my pocket. 
And she'll whip them out there. Health. Okay, so if I don't if I don't hit, there's like no target. It's actually quite difficult to hit that one. Ah, and my my like Y button, my middle ability is a short range now, which I wasn't used to before. Oh, there's more chests than this one. Good. Mandate to find the restaurant. Nice. Very nice. Absolutely nothing wrong with a little mandate. These dragons are cool. You can't change the direction of cast after you've cast them, though. That's my one wish, is that I could change the direction of cast, but it is what it is. It works. Ah, uh, see, I missed there, and that did not help. Ow. Ow. The sight of your signature ice blast earlier. Okay, what have we got? Receive healing equal to 10% gold. Pushing 10 enemies into pits will reward you with 200 gold. This relic is destroyed afterwards. Increase your movements. Ooh, movement speed. Yeah, let's take movement speed. I gave it 10 dragons, but it killed an ends when the stars 6. Yeah, you could you can cast 6, it is pretty decent. I did notice that. I think I'm going to try and wait for the 10, though, even though if you miss them, you, you don't get any damage, you know? But the dragons are cool. And my, my little relic that I've got gives me bonus damage to dragons as well. And now I can freeze them. I can freeze the enemies as well. Did you play the first one of this fluffy now? Let's see what we got here. B. Aero. Ooh. Oh, this is the one we like. We like this one. Or do we take Aqua Bubble? Plus 30% damage to afflicted enemies. Nah, we take Aqua Bubble. 100%. Because. Afflicted enemies is going to be frozen enemies, surely. So if I freeze them and then I hit them with the aqua bubble, big damage. Yes? You watch people play after. Fair enough. Hold on, let's try this. Look. Boom, boom. Okay, it's actually got a really small, um, like, cast area. Dragons. Oh, you can get it in a line, though, I guess. We can send it in a line. We could send it in a straight line. That's not terrible. So it does 20 to him. How much does it do to you? 15. So it does do extra damage to Frozen. Why could you have the S bubble? I think you can only take one S with you into a, into a thing, but you can take multiple when you're like, because you can pick up another one. I don't know why, I don't know. Maybe I'm just menuing wrong and I just not figured out how to equip two of them. <laughs> I think it's because you can pick one up in the run. Whoa, hey big, hey big man. Oh, he didn't get any drag in there. He's dead. 
Oh, how long does the, the orb goes? The orb kind of goes hard. Splat. Oh, did he do like a double slam there? Good. That got me. That is gone. Whoa! Hold on a second. Everybody's dead. That's a lot of damage. I feel like that guy. Who's the guy that does the flex seal? And he like, I sawed this boat in half. That's a lot of damage. Ooh, what we got? So the right hand fights with you, but won't aggro enemies. The axe will kill an enemy next stand and does 20% more damage. Deal 10% more damage for each status effect. Receive 20% more gold. Get 10 gold when you're hit. How much health have I got? We're at 210 out of 275. We're chilling for health. I kind of want to try the right hand. We seen this. Ooh. So we seen this on the first run, but we didn't have the money to get it. So what does it do? Oh, it fires ice. Okay. Okay, it fires ice. Not against it, not against it. The other one fires, uses fire as well, so they must work together. Oh, there's one of these portals again, look. I'm so much better prepared for this portal. So much better prepared. Did I check up that bit up the top there? I don't think I missed anything. We're going in here. Whoa! This one's different. Hey, it's the guy! Oh, he's a stone. He's a stone guy. Welcome to the wildest tournament in the floating lands. The trials of legend may test your mettle, but my tournament is where things get truly fierce. Where's the sound effects for his abilities? Step up and join my special challenge. Oh, and the first rule of the tournament? Talk about it. Because this one's too wild to keep quiet. Let's get warmed up. We are fighting him? Oh, I missed the sea. Take your prize and rest up. The tournament's far from over. Take my prize. Wait, now I have an I've got a third one. Hold on a second. What? I can now do this as well as this and this. Okay, that was worth it. I thought I was going to have to fight more than just him to be honest, but uh obviously not. We do this, and this and this. Well, I don't or not. I just dashed off again. This guy is so annoying, man. I lost more health to that guy on this bridge than I did the boss guy. What are we getting this time? Oh, it's not. It doesn't look like it's the frost one this time. Different boss. Take your time trying to use the turret a bit more, maybe. Is that. It's like Goku. Get ready! Get ready! Oh, that's painful to listen to. Ah!
Oh, he's hit me with everything there. Next time, be quicker, be sharper. Oh my like days! This game has potential. I can see it. I can see where they're going with it. Did you know that being the clerk also means approving paperwork? Any new tasks? No. Hieronymus keeps forgetting my name. Or is pretending oh, to yeah. at least. Not great, was it? For months. You Not great. You hold Aji de Hock's eye next to your heart. That relic was named... Alethea is rather young to run the task board. You're back, so... I'm back. My tournament's winners are statistically more likely well, to pass the trials. I mean, hey, At least that's what the game's pretty good. Me. It's It's got a couple issues. There's some things, obviously, it's still very early access. Or at least it feels like it's very early access. It's... I wanted to play it, to check it out, see what it was like, see how it got on. And I quite like it. I think it's going to be pretty good in the future. It just needs a little bit of work just now, you know? Well, yeah, I mean, Wizard Legend, it's got potential. It, it will be good. With time, when it, when, I don't know what the store page is saying for it right now. Mixed on the store. Yeah. People are having problems with the game running. Co-op's buggy. Yeah, there's definitely some features that feel missing. It definitely doesn't feel polished. It doesn't have that finished polish feel to it. It It's definitely missing a bit of that. There seemed to be too much like Hades. It seemed like as unique as it was last time. Yeah, I think they've kind of taken the success of Hades and been like, damn, we need to try and go down that route a bit more. Which, I mean... Hades is really good. Hades is like cream of the crop roguelike game. And it's really good. And that did feel like Hades a bit. What I was saying earlier was that I want it to be... I don't know if Elikar's here or Zokari's here, but we played Spellbreak where you could... You were a, you were a wizard and you combined your abilities and it made such a difference being able to like combine um like you were combining stuff what are they called abilities you, the spell types and things so you would throw poison down you throw a tornado on it it turns into like a poison tornado or like you freeze the ground and then you can electrify it and stuff like that like it, that's what i want that to be but they need to add in some kind of system to combine all of that stuff together. Because it doesn't seem like they've got it. They have ones like the frozen one there. When an enemy has a status effect on it, you do more damage. But it's not really combining them in the way that I would want it to be combined. So. Yeah. Fable 3 did it first. What did Fable 3 do? I don't, I've not played any Fable games. The next Fable that comes out will probably be my first Fable game. I think that looks pretty good. So, yeah, that that was one of the big selling points for Spellbreak was how how like you combined everything together and you could cause like big explosions and stuff like that. It was cool. That was what was fun, you know. Anyway, that was spell. That was uh, not Spellbreak. That was Wizard of Legend Two. Wizard of Legend Two, pretty good. Not terrible. Not terrible. It's got a lot of potential. I I would like to see where it goes in the future. Um, I think it will do well in the future as it grows. And as it becomes a bit more um, flushed out, I'm going to use I'm going to use the term flushed out. Once it becomes better, 